Welcome back to the channel. In today's Plan Swift Shorts video, it's all about the tabs. And I'm calling this More Tabs Please. And why is that? Because when I'm taking off a job and I'm going back and forth to different plan sheets or drawings, I like to bring up multiple tabs so I can easily get to them. Because, you know, when I start up, I may be dealing with a plan set that's dozens or maybe even hundreds of pages, and I'm working back and forth in maybe three or four different drawings, and I don't want to have to find them back and forth each time, so I just bring them up into a new tab. So let's talk about that and get right into it. Okay, normally when you're in plans with, and I assume you've been in plans with a little while now, you basically see the view of whatever plan you're on. And I keep my pages and bookmarks on the left side. Yours may be on the right side or somewhere else. But um, typically, you're working one sheet at a time. But if you're going back and forth to compare maybe sheets of different versions or different floors, it's nice to be able to bring up a secondary tab or even more tabs so you can go back and forth quickly, especially if you're dealing with a large plan set. So what is a tab and how does it work? It's really simple. You'll notice that when you're anytime you're in the main screen here looking at the sheet, you see the sheet and regardless of, of how it's blown up, if you simply go out all the way, zoom out, and just right click like up at the top, for example, you'll see you'll see once you right click, a dialog box that gives you a choice of several things and one of them is new tab and when you click on new tab what happens is it creates a tab of the sheet you were on and then goes and says select a page for a new tab and you can go over to the left and you can pick a different sheet and now in the upper left hand corner you see that you've got tabs for different sheets and you can continually add, as long as you're on one of those tab marks, to add another tab. And you can keep going all the way across the screen if you like. And I'm going to do a couple more. And let's do one more. And I'm just right-clicking on the, on the tab label and saying new tab and it brings up another one and there you go I have got five tabs currently loaded so think about it this way you're going back and forth from one sheet to another how nice and convenient that is and not having to go back to the pages and bookmarks section to find something another advantage to having tabs open is that you can undock a tab so let's say you're running two monitors and you want to compare basically two plans up on the screen at the same time. All I have to do is undock one of the tabs and I just go up and I say right click and I say undock. And now it pulls up a different window. I can now pull that over to my other monitor and while I'm uh, looking at that I can be working on another tab. So the advantage is that I can have two sheets open on my monitors at one time by simply undocking. And how do I reverse this? How to get it back in? Well, it doesn't snap back in. All you need to do is close the drawing and it will snap back in automatically. And when you're through with those tabs, you can simply go up there and say close and it gets rid of that tab. So more tabs, please. This is a great feature, and try it out. We think you'll like it. We'll see you next time.